हेलो एवरीवन सो यह कम्स द फाइनल टॉपिक फॉर दोज क्यूरियस स्टूडेंट्स हु रियली वांट टू नो द रियल सिग्निफिकेंस ऑफ एरिथमेटिक मीन विथ आल्सो सम कॉन्स आई आई विल बी स्टेटिंग बोथ ऑफ दीज सो दैट वी विल गेट टू नो इन विच केसेस वी कैन यूज एरिथमेटिक मीन और इन विच केसेज वी कान यूज एरिथमेटिक मीन सो वेलकम बैक टू इकोनॉमिक्स मेड ईजी लेट जस्ट स्टार्ट advantages as you can see i have given two examples temperature and your scores now whenever you read a newspaper in the morning you can see only one temperature is there for the whole day long but when you observe minutely you can see at every time period be it in the morning be it in the afternoon evening or night temperatures are quite different right but why these newspapers or the channels state only one particular temperature here comes the significance of arithmetic mean because it's not possible to it's not possible to you know make them aware that what's the temperature of the whole day long with so many degrees because as we are busy in our life so in this hustle we don't give that much importance to calculate temperature or to spend time on finding it out we only cares whenever we go on a vacation in order to check what kind of clothes we should pack so that's why here comes the arithmetic mean significance okay the second example is your scores now as you can see whenever you get your result your scores based on the average of all the scores that you have got and that also denotes that it helps in comprehending or calculating in a easier way the importance or the or you can say what the whole data wants to say and as you have watched my previous videos of arithmetic mean you can see that each and every video you will get more and more clearer concept of arithmetic mean if you haven't watched it you should okay now the disadvantages everything have its pros as well as cons pros are important to know where should we use this concept and cons are important for knowing where we shouldn't use this concept so now my first point is sensitive to extreme data now here is the example i have taken purposely five observation with one extreme observation and i have found out that the mean is 1720 which doesn't comprehend what the data is saying why because arithmetic mean is extreme is sensitive to extreme numbers or volatile data sets so whenever you have a lot of volatility in the data set if the numbers are quite changing you can't use arithmetic mean for example in the stock market the price always fluctuate a lot right so in that case you can't find out arithmetic mean because it it will never comprehend what the data is saying as i have mentioned earlier arithmetic mean is one of the measure of central tendency if it doesn't says what the data is saying then it's not relevant for using it okay so in that case we can't use arithmetic mean okay now the second point is it's not suitable for data set for time series data set for my naive students i want to say that in finance you often work with percentage returns over series of multiple time periods so in order to calculate every average percentage return over multiple periods of time arithmetic mean is useless 
as it fails to take different bases in every year into consideration. And that's why we can't use arithmetic mean when we have to consider different time periods. Okay. I just hope you got this concept clear in your head. Subscribe to our channel and okay, I'm buying I'm signing off now. Bye bye. Take care. Thank you so much for watching.